This vehicle has been provided for Corey Fulham Car Guide to Film by Wilson Chevrolet Buick and GMC of New Liskard, Ontario. At Wilson Chevrolet Buick and GMC, they have a good selection of new Chevrolet vehicles, Buick and GMC vehicles, and as well as a good selection of pre-owned vehicles. To check out their full inventory, feel free to stop by at wilsonchevrolet.ca. For additional information about Wilson Chevrolet Buick and GMC, check out the description below where you'll find information like their telephone number and their address. What's up guys, Corey Fulham, your car guy here. Today I've got a video for you of this all new 2023 Chevrolet Trailblazer LS. This is a front wheel drive only vehicle and it's wearing a mosaic black metallic exterior with jet black cloth interior. And then you can also get one with all wheel drive too, as well. So the tire sizes on the Trailblazer LS are actually wearing a 225, 60 or 17s cotton metal tires over here anyways we'll just go step inside over here it does have a typical style switchblade key over here by gm black exterior right there over here it does not have color accent stitching on the steering wheel there Starts right out. So we'll go close the door over here. Now once you're inside the Trailblazer LS, you get a nice three-spoke steering wheel over here with sport grips to give a little sporty feel right there. So the Trailblazer has two different transmission choices available for 2023. One is the nine-speed automatic transmission and this particular continuously variable transmission, which also known as CVT. And it does have manual shift ability over here if you want to shift it manually. When you put the vehicle in reverse, your backup camera appears with guidance lines right there. So this particular Trailblazer LS does have a touch screen along with AM FM radio, Sirius XM satellite radio, Bluetooth streaming, Apple CarPlay, and Android Auto over here. Okay. The Toronto Raptors are at home to the here on the touch field. screen over here, you can go to sound over here. Change your equalizer settings over here, balance and fade right there. And you got browse, browse through all the different stations right there. And here, you got Sirius XM, back to FM right there. And then you got Bluetooth right there. And then you got this one, which is the OnStar's turn by turn directions. Here, you got Bluetooth phone, Wi Fi settings OnStar services it does have OnStar right up there with your OnStar buttons and your OnStar emergency buttons right up there then we scroll left you can see what's playing over here no phone connected climate controls are located over here as well AC temperature fan settings front and rear defrost right over here and you got two USB ports over here and an auxiliary audio input jack 12 volt power outlet there and then you got your lane keeping assist button over here activated by the switch there and then you got traction off over here activated by the button turn it on or off if you like and it does have an automatic start stop technology activated by this button there it's actually a fuel saving feature when you come up to a red light it'll automatically turn off the car and then when you let your foot off the brake it'll start back up Electronic parking brake is located over here. You just pull up to engage it and then it'll tell you if the parking brake is set. If you want to disengage the parking brake, hold your foot on the brake and then just press it again right there. And now the parking brake is released. The driver information screen controls are located over here. I'm going to zoom in so you can see. Fuel level low. And we got this one over here. We got digital speedometer right there. Trip one, trip two, fuel range, uh, fuel economy, average fuel economy, average vehicle speed, and uh, remaining oil life. 
and you got air filter life right there, tire pressure, falling distance indicator, and then we got units over here, and then we got fuel economy right there, top consumers, and we got eco index right there. Your hands-free telephone controls are located over here. And then you got your steering wheel audio mounted controls, your volume controls over here. And then you got your previous and next buttons over here. And scroll through all the different stations. Is Ranch Country. Temporary book called They Both Die at the End. It's actually kind of cool. Cruise control is located over here, selected by the button right there. And now to mention your automatic high beam switch over here, it's only for use at night time. All right, so anyways, we're gonna go ahead and flip on the automatic headlights and check that out as well. And we'll switch on the hazards. Automatic driver's side window over here. And we'll go check out the exterior, shall we? So let's go pop the front and we'll check out the engine. So the Trailblazer LS does have a 1.2 liter double overhead cam turbocharged three cylinder engine producing 137 horsepower at 5,000 RPM and 162 foot pounds of torque at 2,500 RPM. Okay. So we'll go shut it down. And we'll go check out the rest of the vehicle. It's actually kind of cool. Right here you can see the driver's side there. Cargo space. Now I'll go check out the back over here. You press on this pad over here and it will open the tailgate there. So it's all extra cargo space right over here. It does come with this cargo mat over here, Chevrolet cargo mat. Engine block heater cord over here. And uh, some instructions over here. And some spare screws right here. The back seats do fold down. I'm gonna show you that right now. You just pull the button right there and the seat will come down just like that. Same thing on the other side there. So I'll close it up over here. I'll go check out the passenger side over here. Doom lights on top there. Glove box. It does come with the owner's manual with your important safety information right there. Sirius XM guide right there. All weather floor mats by Chevrolet, right there. Well everyone, I hope you enjoy my review on the all new 2023 Chevrolet Trailblazer LS. Be sure to stay tuned next time for more videos just like this. And remember, as always, like, subscribe, favorite, and don't forget to check out my other videos. Be sure to stay tuned next time. There's always a lot more where it came from. Take care guys.